Hello friends, this video on basic concepts of chemistry part 4 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 3. Now we'll take some properties of matter. So we talk about, we'll talk about physical and chemical properties. Physical properties are those properties which can be measured or observed without changing the identity of a matter. For example, I have a matter, I have a ball. Just by looking at this, I can tell the color. I can tell the smell by smelling. I can tell the melting point also, I can tell the boiling point. So those things, I can take the density because I'm not changing the identity of the ball for that, right? So for those things, if you see, I'm not changing this uh, uh, identity of the ball and I'm able to tell. Those properties are called physical properties, correct? So tell a physical property of a matter, you don't need to change the identity of the substance. but to measure the chemical property, you have to go, uh, I mean, you have to go through a chemical reaction. For example, if you want to find the acidity or basicity of a particular mixture, uh, particular, let's suppose, uh, solution, you have to go for acid test. So the moment you are going to acid based litmus test, you're talking about a chemical reaction, right? If you want to find the combustibility of a uh, material, you have to actually burn it. So for example, there's a book, there are two different uh, materials. One is, let's suppose, wood. And then it's paper. You want to find which one is more combustible. You have to actually burn it, right? Without burning, you won't be able to find. So, in that case, you can say that chemical property, to find the chemical property, you have to actually, uh, the particular object ha or matter has to go through a chemical change. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos. Try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.